no scope gaming glasses actually work. Make sure to check out the link in the description to learn more and purchase them for yourself. Welcome back to Asian Reviews and today we're going to be reviewing a few puck lights from Torch Star. This is the LED puck light MV3 pack with the remote which features a 50 lumen illumination with a 120 degree sort of put out. It has a magnetic design and a battery sort of feature instead of a wired plug-in feature. And it features the daylight light so that's just a reference for you. Anyways, uh, I kind of slaughtered the box on the initial unboxing, so sorry for that. You can take a look at the features if you'd want, and in the box you can see all of the products, including the batteries, the mounting hardwares, the puck lights itself, and the wireless remote. Anyways, um, I already unboxed the product, so I'm just going to be pulling out all the cool items that are included. So... Right out of the box, we have some 3M tape. We have four packets of little screws and anchors for your wall. We have a screw sliding mount for your remote. Just a little sliding mount that you can screw onto your wall or 3M tape it. And we have the three LED puck lights itself. They have two magnets on the back so that you can stick it onto anything metal, so that is definitely a plus. You can see the you can see the two little attachments if you were looking to use the anchors and screws for your wall. Anyways, uh, all the batteries are included for the remote as well as the three puck lights. And they are not some off-brand, well, they're not really some off-brand uh, brand of batteries. They're Panasonic batteries. So, uh, I don't know, I just felt like mentioning that. Anyways, uh, you can attach this to the wall if you would like as well as the puck lights itself. The puck lights feature six different LED lights on the front, as well as a power button to power the light on. On the back side, you can see that we have the magnets, which I already looked at, and we have the battery pack, which features, I believe it is, three AA batteries. Anyways, moving along to the remote, we have four settings that you can use with the remote. We have the dash, circle, low, and 30 minutes. As you can see, when you press the on button, which would be the dash, all the lights will light up. To turn them off, you press the circle button, and as you can see, they do turn off in the background. To press 30 minutes, you would get a 30 minute timer for the bright setting. Press the low button, and it will have a lower light, as you can tell the difference here. So that's definitely nice that they have that feature. Anyways, I should have some footage up now, which is some night footage with these puck lights scattered around my room. I didn't really need it for my closet since, you know, my closet's pretty well lit, but they definitely work with the closet as well. I kind of like them scattered around the room to try to showcase everything that I have up on these shelves. Anyways, the lighting effects are really, really nice, and it kind of puts off enough light so that it's a good sleeping light, and it's just enough light to read a night book or some night YouTube. It won't strain your eyes like it would if you wouldn't have it, so that is definitely nice. Anyways, that pretty much wraps it up for this review of the Torch Star 3-pack and remote of the LED puck lights. Again, it has a wireless uh, remote capability of up to 50 feet, so that's just a reference for you. And it can definitely go up to past 50 feet, in my opinion. I've gone up to my room, gone downstairs, actually gone to a neighbor's house, and they will still turn on, so that is definitely nice. Anyways, thanks Torchstar for sending me these products to review. Make sure to subscribe to see uh, all my latest videos and new videos and past videos if you are interested to see some of my other reviews. Anyways, uh, make sure to like this video if you did enjoy, and it will support me and the channel so I can bring you these reviews more often. Anyways, if you have more recommendations of what I should review next, make sure to leave them in the comment section down below. If you have any questions, also leave them in the comment section down below. I'll be happy to answer them, and make sure to check out my Amazon page to see all my written reviews. Anyways, I'll see you in the next video. Peace!